Hello, my name is Kelly Workington, and I'm a plumbing instructor at the Red Deer School of Trades and Technologies, and I am the Mathematic Plumber. And in today's Conversion Quickie, we're going to learn how to take feet, inches, and fractions of an inch, and convert that into feet and decimal feet. So like all my videos, I'm going to go through an example. And then I'm going to give you an opportunity to do a second example, and I'll go through it with you once you're done. In this example, we're going to have 4 foot 10 and 7 eighths of an inch. We need to convert this to feet and decimal feet. So let's write out our feet, inches, and fractions of an inch separately on the piece of paper. Let's start with our fraction of an inch. We need to take 7 eighths of an inch and convert that into decimal inches. To do that, we take the top number, 7, divided by 8, the bottom number. This will give us 0 0.875 inches. Now we need to take our whole inches and add it to our decimal inches. So 10 plus 0 0.875 inches equals 10.875 inches. Now we need to convert these inches and decimal inches back into feet. So I need to take 10.875 inches and divide it by 12 inches per foot. This will give me 0 0.906 feet. Finally, I need to take my decimal feet and add it to my whole feet. So I should get 4.906 feet. Well, let's bring out our tape measures to check our answer. So let's draw a line down from 4 foot 10 and 7 eighths inches on a regular tape measure through our engineer's tape measure. You should be able to see that this lines up fairly nicely with 4.906 feet or just a tiny bit more than 4.9 feet on the ruler. And now finally the last example. It's your turn. I have a measurement of 7 foot 2 and 1 16th of an inch. Please pause the video and convert this into feet and decimal feet. So on our spare piece of paper we're going to want to separate our feet inches and fractions of an inch like we've been doing the whole time. Once again we're going to start with the fraction of an inch. We need to convert 1 16th of an inch into a decimal inch. To do this I take the top number 1 and divide it by the bottom number 16 and I should get a number like this 0 0.0625 inches. Now I need to take that number and add it to my whole inches which is 2 and I should get 2.0625 inches. Now I need to convert those inches into feet. So I'm going to take 2.0625 inches and divide it by 12 inches per foot. Now I'm going to get a pretty small number here with a lot of decimal places behind it. So that should give you 0 0.171875 feet. Now I'm going to take that number and add it on to my whole feet, which is 7. So 7 plus that number should give me 7.172 feet if I round it off. Alright, let's check this answer against our tape measures. Let's draw a line down from 7 foot 2 and 1 16th inches through our engineer's tape measure. And, well, we'll probably need to pause the video to see this one properly, but it should travel through 7.172 feet. Well, thank you for watching my video. Don't forget to hit the like button or subscribe before you leave. And if you have any suggestions about a video I can do in the future, please leave that idea in the comment section below.